Hi, this is what I call the Groove Buddy. Basically, it's a combination of hardware and software that uh, provides an easy interface to control the settings which are not exposed on the front panel of the Roland EG101 or the Roland MC303. So how does it work? Well, the game Duino takes input from this touch screen and converts it to MIDI commands which are then sent to the synthesizer via this very simple MIDI interface here. You'll see the MIDI, uh, MIDI cable runs from that interface into the back of the synthesizer here. For example, the synthesizer is now in poly mode and if I press keys down, we sound a chord. But if I press the poly button here to switch it into mono mode, it's now in mono, and if I try to press a chord, it only plays one key at a time. Here's a de demo of the patch selection functionality of the Groove Buddy. We select the patches button, and it gives us a list of the, all the different uh, patch categories. Um, let's say we want to choose a nice organ. Choose the organ button and um, how about a 60s organ. And uh, that immediately sets the synth into synth patch to that particular patch. Just go back and uh, put it into poly mode. Then if we want to find a nice synth, gonna, uh, look here and we can see we've got a cool 2600 Pulse 90. Select that and see what it sounds like. That's pretty cool. Let's try JP8 square. We can also set which of the eight uh, reverb presets or chorus presets the EG101 is, is going to use. So for instance, if we choose reverb here, we can uh, choose a delay, a delay reverb patch, which will basically give us a delay effect when we play. And then we can adjust the reverb parameters using the front panel. We can also select which chorus patch we want to use and also set the chorus level. Um, for now, let's uh, leave the chorus patch as it is and just test how the level works. So with no chorus dialed in, with the slider at the bottom here, um, it sounds like this. And if we dial in a bit of reverb, can change the patch we can also change bend and modulation settings by default um, the default bend range on the on the synthesizer is set to only two 
half notes but uh, so you get this kind of effect happening but we can ramp it up to uh, way up to 24 if we want to and bend 24 notes this is bending 19 notes the synth section of the Groove Buddy menu uh, allows you to change the vibrato and the envelope of the current patch that's in memory so if we play something with no vibrato settings set up we get this kind of a sound but if we dial in some vibrato you'll hear the difference we can also change the attack of the note and um, we give it a very long attack Very short attack. And also change the decay and the release. I'm just going to change the release here, give it a very long release so you can hear the difference. Hit the note, and I'm just going to hit it and release it at the same time. So the note is released now, but K is on playing. And that's it. That's the whole demo of the Groove Buddy for EG101 and MC303. Cheers.